Congratulations, John. My name is Nabatel. I host the show called So Much to Talk About in New York City, and I wanted to ask you how important was the stability of the Utah organization to have Coach Sloan for 15 years and to have Carl Malone with you for 18 years and just with the NBA, with free agency and everything like that, the instability of a lot of franchises. How important was that stability to help um, inspire your career? Well, I think the stability was largely brought on by our owner, Larry Miller. He, he, he didn't have any knee-jerk reactions. And, because we had good times and we had bad times, but uh, he didn't have anything knee jerk and start firing guys and trading guys. I think the stability is huge. First of all, you have to know who the, who the boss is, and clearly Jerry was the boss. If, if that's convoluted in any way, uh, your team's going to have difficulties. And, and when the ownership and the, everybody stands behind coach like they have, uh, you can have a successful team. It allows people to coach, allows Jerry to coach, allowed us to play. And um, from, a, from a personal standpoint. I didn't have it any other way. I've never seen it any other way, so I don't have anything to compare it to, but it sure made it cozy uh, and comfortable and, and really allows you to, to be all that you can be. We really allow that phrase. John Blake Jeff, I suppose, from you spoke in. John, uh, going back to your rookie year, I, I kind of remember you saying that, that after that first paycheck, everything was, was going to be gravy. How big did you allow yourself to dream back then? The, well, I thought, I think I'm, I'm alluding to what you're talking about, or getting you know, what you're talking about is the, uh, I didn't think they, I, th I thought they'd figure me out pretty quickly. I thought the Jazz would figure out that they'd made a mistake. Um, <laughs> so I saved every cent. I, I did get the first paycheck, saved every cent. I uh, rented a one bedroom apartment that was already furnished and uh, never bought a television set. Uh, went to a discount food store. Bought cans of Nally's chili and made my mom's lasagna and stacked it in the fridge. So I was pretty sure I was a one year and out guy. Uh, I don't know if that ever changed. I think if you asked my wife who's sitting over there with my family, that uh, she'd say that part of me hasn't changed much. Okay, we'll take one last question from Freddie. Can you talk about your uh, relationship with Carl Malone and, and how important he was in, in your career's success and, and just that synergy that the two of you had, that pick, famous pick and roll stock with Malone? Well, everybody would have great synergy with Carl Malone. The guy, can, he, he's, he's just such a phenomenal athlete. He'd catch the ball if you throw it at his shoelaces. If you, if you try to throw it over the backboard, he'd go get it there. Uh, furthermore, he'll catch it, then complete the play with three guys draped on him. So, uh, his, his impact on my career and on my teammates' career is really immeasurable. Uh, it, it's off the charts. And, and, and as a friend, we've learned so much about each other. Uh, we come from two different environments, two different worlds, and, and, uh, and meshed quickly and continuously for a long, long time. So a uh, great friend and, and a thrill to have spent nearly my whole career with.